Good morning Taurus, welcome to your general reading. My name is Clive, you're watching Emery's Tarot. It's my great pleasure to be here and read for you today. New viewers and subscribers, everybody's welcome to watch this video. The only thing I have to say before we get into the reading, this is more for new viewers and new subscribers, cross watchers. Please take the bits that resonate, leave the rest. Don't try and make it fit as this will just lead you to wrong conclusions. My regular viewers will always know this because I, I say this message for the sake of new people watching this video. So without further ado, let's see what energies we have for the sign of Taurus. Okay, that's good. See what's going on with the cards here for you. You're very powerful energy today, Taurus, because you're showing up in your own reading as I'm shuffling, okay? Hierophant, this is Taurus energy. It's very, very strong at the moment. So, here we go. You have the Knight of Cups following your own heart's desire. The world card, you've come full circle on yourself. You've gone through a life cycle, Taurus. Hermit. Virgo. Mm. There's either a lot of Virgo in you or you're dealing with somebody with a lot of Virgo energy. Ten of Wands. Finally finding some kind of peace. Ten of Pentacles. Wow. Two tens there. You know, these are minor arcana cards. There's big changes in your circumstances and there's big changing in for a lot of you in your career as well. You're being pressurised in your career. Okay, I'm getting there's a lot of pressure at home also. You know, the cost of living and that's going through the roof everywhere in the world. Okay, it's becoming more and more expensive. But with your career, I'm kind of getting a change of career here. In relationships, I am getting that there is somebody in particular that you've been in disagreement with. This could have been somebody you're dating, somebody you're seeing, somebody you're living with, somebody you're married to. Okay, the energy remains the same. You've contemplated this situation for a long, long time. But what I am getting most of all prominent with you is the fact that there's a message coming from someone, okay, for some of you at a distance, all right, because with this world card here, I'm getting travel. All right. But most of all, I'm getting a much more peace and harmonious energy around you or approaching you. You see, as I say, you've gone full circle. Okay. But this, this time you're much wiser. You're much more stable. There's been a lot of erratic energy around you in the past the last 10 years or so have been very up and down with you and very very challenging and those challenges and obstacles in your life there's I'm kind of getting here there's for one or two of you your ambitions in work have not been able to be fulfilled well this energy around you says here that you know after a long struggle finally there is movement okay and you're going to need to take a step back to think about what it is you truly want. You have got all the answers within you. Look into other people for answers to a degree. Okay, I'm talking about spiritually and emotionally now. You don't need to. They're within you. Yes, of course, if you're dealing with an outside authority, lawyers, law etc or looking for answers from a state agent or whatever for the sale of a home yes of course you need answers from somebody else but i'm kind of getting in here there was one particular relationship that has been a struggle okay and just when you least expect it i'm getting messages coming in okay on the face of it, it will perhaps make you very very happy your intuition has been telling you this person would always contact you and that is turning out to be correct for a lot of you okay but the challenge here is you know we've got this energy around you of the world's your oyster now and that produces a lot of excitement okay 
you know, you have been contemplating your situation for a long, long while. All right, you've been putting a lot of effort in, all right, to make some changes, and some of those changes are taking place. The biggest challenge for you will be to curb your excitement. Okay, because there is a message approaching you on getting a bit like a message in a bottle there perhaps will require a quick answer which does put pressure on you okay but there is a new love in your life or there's a certainly a very de developing friendship okay perhaps this is somebody you've been working with or has been around you in your circle of close friends etc the feelings of growing and it's catching you unawares okay there's you're perhaps dealing with a soulmate in fact on getting from one or two of you you're dealing with two soulmates yes you can have more than two one, one soulmate okay and this soulmate can be anybody mother father sister brother a child anybody okay so some of you are dealing with a soulmate but there's there's a lot of healing in a particular relationship, okay, and it does invoke a decision, and this decision means leaving behind to a degree, at least energetically, it means leaving the past behind, perhaps not forgetting what's happened, but forgiving it, and some of you are making a decision between your present situation and somebody new, so you're sort of caught in the middle energetically between your past and your future, all right. But everything's going to come to a head. There is a new opportunity here. And for some of you, that does involve a job opportunity that involves travel. Okay. Now, with this, not only comes karma, not only comes a decision, but legalities. Now, you could be trying to sell a house, buy a house, whatever, on getting good news coming in about that. Perhaps you've put an offer in on a house. Okay. And I've been waiting. And then all of a sudden that news comes through. But it kind of comes with a time limit. So you have to work very, very quickly. Mm. Your ability to adapt to the changing situation is... Will affect the way you go forward. If, if you're a long time before you can adapt, then you're going to have to work a little bit harder, I'm afraid, especially on yourself and your energy. All right, but if you're, if you're very lucky and you can adapt very, very quickly to changes in circumstances, especially abrupt changes, then I'll get in here, you know, you'll lead the way. You won't be led anymore. All right. Some of you are dealing with an ex, okay, but you do feel restricted, a lot of you. So there's, at the moment, this you could be dealing with more than one person, as I say. You could be dealing with two or even three. I'm getting Libra energy here. I'm getting Virgo energy here. Now you've got Capricorn energy. You know, perhaps another Earth sign. A lot like you. Okay. The thing is, I'm getting that you've learned a hard lesson. Okay, your approach to life family matters, work matters, it's much more of a temperate value value you're putting on life, okay? There's there's no longer between you and somebody the extremes. You know, the hot cold energy, the in and out, the very erratic energy, the not knowing. This news does bring in a lot of joy on getting. It is a very intense relationship for some of you. Okay. But, you know, there's, I'm getting from one of you, you've been dealing with somebody with perhaps an addiction, very narcissistic, they're promised to get help, advice, okay, they're really trying, but, you know, it's going to be a long haul, okay. This Seven of Pentacles here is, is saying to me that, uh, for you, that, you know, despite the long haul, it's don't lose face because don't lose face or faith. Get it right, Clive. Put your teeth back in. Okay, don't lose faith in yourself. 
All right. There's a reignition of feelings and emotions here with somebody from the past, certainly on their side. They've realised what they've lost. They've had time to think about it. Okay. Mm, see what else we have. Oh, so now you have another 10. So your love life, your family life, your career life, your work life. There's a lot of changes around you. It's like everything at once. Mm. Now, even if you're married, the person you're dealing with is married. Okay, there is this energy that, uh, you know, your circumstances are going to change. I am getting travel. I'm getting many, many changes. It's kind of a self-sacrificial energy here to pursue the route you want to put, follow. Okay, you're going to lose something that's quite valuable right now. In other words, whether you're, where you're living is quite comfortable. It's prosperous in some ways for some of you, but it's a question to pursue this. It's kind of a restart, okay? Let's get this to a cups. Yeah, this person was a player type energy, okay? But I'm kind of getting they're coming in very, very different now. You know, you put your life on hold in the past. Okay. And this time when they come round, because you're much wiser, much more temperate, you know, there's st there is still that excitement. But you're kind of not rushing in. That's what I'm getting. You are seeing the truth of the situation. In fact, you're getting control. Now, for those of you that are dealing with a soulmate, you are definitely going to control the speed it goes and how far it goes. But this person is coming in very, very differently. Okay. This devil here. Yeah. It's a question on whether this person... This person is certainly very attracted to you. They're very passionate. But they're, they're, they're thinking the moment... There is a third party involvement for some of you, you now whether this is a child. Okay, but the, they're living the moment. They are not thinking long term. So you've kind of got to, well, not got to do anything actually, but I'm getting that you're in the you're in the energy of you're kind of doing the thing, the thinking for them. You're certainly thinking long term. OK, this person does make you happy in a lot of ways, despite the the challenges and problems that come with this avenue you're, that is put in front of you. Some of you will follow it and have the willpower and the strength to carry. Some of you will see it as, you know, perhaps not worth it and dismiss it. But I, I either way, there is a decision there. OK, thanks very much for watching.